Yeah. Speaking of Teenage Mutant Ninja Turtles. Yeah, yeah. Um, <laughs> okay. Kylian Mbappe. Mbappe, Mbappe, Kili, Kili. Kili, Kili. Yeah. <laughs> yeah, Did you see that Twitter uh, video of the duck? With the, with, the, <laughs> yeah. with the flock of ducks and someone quote tweeted oh, 2014 like the, 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 of the different ones <laughs> and it's this duck going like I've oh, not yeah. seen the one where like he's petting the duck and then he slam, uh, puts it on the table and it transforms into like the duck being dead and he cooks it <laughs> no I oh, that was that, yeah, was, that, was, that was a bit morbid <laughs> I was not agreeing to that one that was actually really dark <laughs> yeah, it was uh, no he has he has confirmed he's leaving yeah uh, is it on a free no it yeah, a free agent it wasn't it yeah that's crazy isn't it mad PSG got Neymar, Messi, and Mbappe to win him a Champions League and they've all left on freeze. And not won the Champions League. Yeah, <laughs> that's a no. Um, do you think Real Madrid are ruining football, Tom? No, I think they've that. If you if you actually look at their signings, they've recruited like brilliant. Alfonso Davies as well now. Yeah, people she's forget fucking like two of any Camavinga. Like they're amazing. Yeah, they signings. are unbelievable. Yeah, they are good signings. And they're Valverde. Gonna, yeah. Are we they, seeing? They've got a new generation. Are we seeing Galacticos being reborn? Yeah, but I don't think they've... It's like youth Galacticos. They haven't signed these players as Galacticos. Yeah, you know you're right. I mean? They've like, turned yeah. them into Galacticos. Yeah. I mean, Be Bellingham's a bit... Di but even Bellingham was young. And but old. Bellingham was... He, it, like, he wasn't he as was, this good. Yeah. yeah, yeah, yeah. And then it, Mbappe would be that. Yeah. I'm not sure how it would work. I don't he'd like him down the middle. You'd have to play through the middle because there's no way they're dropping Vinicius Junior. That's what I'm saying. Or unless they move, unless they get rid of Rodrigo. But Rodrigo goes class. He's unreal, Rodrigo. Vinny to the right. I don't but know. then you don't. Want, why would you buy Mbappe to? They have to play like, through the middle to buy I, another striker. I think Mbappe that, like, wants bit... to be down the middle and get goal yeah, and be a goal scorer. I, I, think, oh, he really? wants, I think he wants yeah. to do yeah, that. Yeah. You know how Henri started as a winger and transitioned through the middle. I think Mbappe sees that and goes, "I want to be Henri." Yeah. Like that. I think. I think he loves him, man. Yeah, why not? Thierry. I think he actually loves him and <laughs> I love them as well. Um, do you, can you not see him going to Arsenal? No. I'd love him to. But Could we what afford I, him? <laughs> I, what I did see is uh, someone that is that, um, someone online, which is obviously a great source of information for discussion. <laughs> um, they were saying whoever Real Madrid try and offload with uh, the money to fund Mbappe, Arsenal should be in for them, regardless of who it is. And I think it's a good idea. Yeah, well, well, who is it though? Rodriguez. Nobody knows. Rodriguez. Yeah, probably no. something like that. Yeah. Exactly. He plays on the right, that's where Saka plays. Ah, he's versatile, he could play. He can, no, he's better on the left, Rodrigo. He, he's Is actually it? a left winger, yeah. He I thought he was a right winger. He then plays on the right because of Vinny. Vinny oh, interesting. Yeah. Ooh la la. He can play either side. Like, and, like, I hate this thing with modern wingers, you can't fucking play either side. Modern wingy? Up. What? You say modern wingy? <laughs> He is obsessive of them, Wingy. He, he, did modern, you, he said you, modern wingers, but I just made a nod in uh, Well, we, uh, also, uh, you talked about seeing stuff <laughs> online. Oh. Um, what We've seen a lot online recently, guys. <laughs> hey! hey! Yeah, yeah. Oh, no, maybe not. Uh. Um, <laughs> it brings on to a little discussion of who is the best or biggest talent currently in the world. Yeah, uh, but, the, but the, barring but this two is, players, this segment is two of them have already been decided. We yeah. just took a third name in there and see what happens. Yeah, yeah. So okay, it, I, right. I think, no, it, we, I, and then we no, then we can debate each other's. Why, why yeah, yeah, that's fine. I can Mbappe be one. He's like twenty five, isn't it? I did think it just this, play, but just it's not. I've never specified it. You're just talking just, about oh, raw natural football, football yeah, talent. talent. Yeah, De Bruyne. Right. I put. Wait, I, Oh. They have to be under 26. No, no. I and he only just has turned 25 in December 20. They don't know that, so we're now saying age no, doesn't matter. Yeah, well, roughly. Today's clip from Pitch Side is brought to you, as always, by our friends over at Super 6. And the last two rounds were almost won. They were so close from getting that £250,000 jackpot. A player in each of those rounds correctly got five out of the six scores to become a top scorer winner. And therefore, they did take home the £6,000 for their efforts. Could you go one further this weekend and correctly predict all six to become a quarter of a million pound richer and remember it's completely free to play so good luck you can also compete against myself Reeve and Tom on the official pitch side of Mini League uh, use the code PTCH23 to join we'll also be giving away a hundred pound classic football shirt voucher every single round so get over to the app or the Super 6 website simply predict six correct scores to become quarter of a million pound richer and remember it's free to play follow the link in the description down below now to sign up yeah. I'll go Phil Foden Okay. As natural talent. Uh, how would you, how would as you rank, natural football talent. How would you rank them three? Mbappe, you, said, you said these are one and two and then whoever's third. No, no, no. You can rearrange them. Oh, it's like uh, himself. Phew, natural talent. Phone is, phew, could be first He's been the, comfortably the best player in the league, I'd say. No, but and in terms of actual natural how, footballing you're, talent, you, how there's no Phil? really... He's not old. He's there's like no one better than him in the world, really. Yeah, you really put him ahead of Mbappe. He's just like a glorified... I would put him ahead of Mbappe. 23 turning 24 this year. At this point in time. I'd go Vinny Jr. Yeah. I, I, yeah. How, how would we? How, how would you organise thingies first before we move on? So yeah, um, uh, I'd go. You just go Mbappe, Bellingham, Foden. Yeah, 
Yeah. What? Well, t- Foden's, I don't Foden's, more, as, but, but Foden's ter- a more technically gifted yeah, yeah. player than probably both of them, but Mbappe's the better. I put him do you last. Think it, uh, do you what? Think Foden. You think Bellingham, Foden's better Ford than Bellingham, Mbappe? Mbappe? What are you Mbappe? doing today? I don't understand what you're what trying you to do. I, 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 would agree with you, I, would, I would agree with that if you're talking about like actual technical Yeah, this is what I'm about. Mbappe no, is Mbappe a Mbappe very is quick and a great finisher, but when it comes down to... so much more than that. Are you blind? Are you actually blind? This guy has technical talent above anyone. He is insane. Uh, I he, no, he, I, I won't go that far. It's, I know. Yeah. Yeah. He's, 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 I think he's being completely disrespectful to no, he, he's brilliant. Talent. He's brilliant. No, he's not well, no, no, that's not, no, no, no. Saying, say saying, that. saying Foden is as good or better than someone doesn't disrespect he's the other person. Last. That's yeah, ridiculous. I think there's three very good players in the line there. He's, Mbappe probably the best player in the world. Most people would argue the best player in the world. No one you've thinks Foden's in, the best put, player You've in the put world. him in this full well knowing that people were going to put him I don't think Foden's anyway. been the best player in the Premier no, season. I, I'm, I'm he's not the best player in the world, uh, is he? First. If I'm honest. I think Bell- Bellingham also has that aura of I feel like he has like a Zidane aura. And he's I know he's obviously number five, so that probably adds to it. But he he's just he's just powerful. And also, I think that we, adds to like that's, that, that, ability. Like that's, 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 that's not necessarily natural we, talent. That's athletic. yeah, but he's just, he's he's a match winner as you well. You know, like Ronaldo's Ronaldo's obviously got an insane amount of natural talent. No one's ever debated that. But like he's worked yeah, yeah, unbelievably 100%. hard on his athleticism. I, I feel like Bellingham. I agree with both of your options though. I've got three options here, and, and one of them was Foden. Yeah, one of them was Vinicius Junior. So I, yeah. And the third one was Haaland. Mm. Yeah, fair enough. Isn't he younger than Foden? Yeah, so if you have Haaland, no, but, uh, but if I'm talking in yeah, natu- if we're talking on natural well. talent and technical ability, sure, look, Isaac is better than Haaland, right? Ha- I- Haaland yeah. is one month older than Foden. Is he older than him? One one you month. Forget how same. young Phil Foden is. Yeah, he's been around yeah. for so long. Same age, the same age. Some so it's, it's a no moving from you in terms of no matter what play you sub in, it's always Mbappe. Uh, Bellingham and then I, I think it in terms of, all, I think in terms of actual, how you want to look at yeah it. yeah well, how are you viewing it because in yeah. terms of actual talent it has to be but, t- if, uh, but like first uh, touch I think Haaland like, you have to mention Haaland I'd argue young. Vinicius Jr has got more talent than Bellingham but Bellingham's got more all round he's got the aura he's got the phys- physicality he's got he's just he's got, the celebration. Round, he's got everything and he? he's got everything like Vinicius you won't go look at him fucking tracking back. See, or... what Tom's doing is, you know the little uh, hexagons that you get on the player stat <laughs> yeah, basis? Yeah, yeah, yeah. Foden is one of those perfect... But then but then Bellingham should be more well-rounded because he's no, a, not he's a midfielder. Like, yeah. It's, yeah. it's one of them, and it? I, 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 I don't know. I think with how he's performing at the minute, you have to say Bellingham second. Uh, who, who, think... Which player is like more sought after? If you could sign any player, so obviously you have the younger Bellingham or you have... I'd Mbappe. say Bellingham. Bellingham. Probably. But probably. What? Is, is... I think if any club in Sorry, the world... Sorry, no, no, no. Young Mbappe... Wait, no, 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 I'm saying Bellingham's from... younger, but, uh, you know... Wait, what are you talking about? I'm saying which player, if you could sign any of them, like, which one's the more sought after? Who would I'd be the most valuable? No, well, I'd yeah. say Bellingham. Mbappe. M- Mbappe's say, top, surely. I'd it's say Mbappe. Bellingham because I don't... There's, I think there's a few clubs who wouldn't trust Mbappe. Mbappe's, like... Um, like how he's been at PSG, he's been a bit of a fucking nightmare, hasn't he? Could you also he, say there's he, less players... I honestly who, think if you lined up every club in the world... Um... He, he, uh, um, um, I think Bellingham would edge it. I think more but would Mbappe's sign him. Mbappe's still over never Mbappe. not performed. I'm not saying that. I'm not saying he's not. I've, I've I've got Mbappe top of my list. I think he's all nah, the rest in the world. Would you say there's less Bellingham than there is Mbappe? You're not signing someone. Be, be, do, no. Way younger. No. He's got what? He's got. He's he's more all round. He's got more no, all round no. game. There's not less Bellingham's than there is Mbappe's. They're both like one of one kind of player. Bellingham, he's 100% would be signed by more clubs than Mbappe. I don't know, man. Of course, you I think you do for think... attitude alone, yeah. Yeah, thank you. No club in the world mm. would turn Bellingham no. down. Some would Mbappe, honestly. No, but I, 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 wait, promise wait, you, I promise you this, no club in the world turns Mbappe down. Yeah, and let, no other, club other, than, other than the over, way structure Over Bellingham, they would, yeah. 100%. Other than the way structure yeah. to afford him, I don't think you, you could no, never turn Why aren't City breaking the bank to go and sign him then? Signing a huge eagle. It's the price. The wages. Oh, because City can't afford that, can No, they? but it, 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 oh, it's five nil Arsenal. Kai Havertz. Because City can't afford the wages, can they? Like, that's really... But they tried all... They they, they went all out. But also, Bellingham. it's not... You have to look at what Liverpool club... Liverpool would, would rather you, have Jude than Mbappe. You have to look at what club needs the positions as well. They're two different positions. I don't... Uh, there's no club in the world that would say no to Bellingham. But there are some that would say I agree. no No, I, I agree. I think it's but the same for both. No, City would say no to Mbappe. I uh, completely disagree. Why? Why are they not going in for him then? Because he's so expensive, and he's going Real Madrid. Why are they not going in for Bellingham right now? They tried to go in for. They tried to sign him. But doesn't. Yeah, but my point is, why are they doing now? Everyone then? tried to sign Bellingham. Not everyone's going to try and sign Mbappe. But Mbappe was locked in at PSG. It's a little bit different. But he's not now. He's on. Who's more valuable? 
in, in well, Do Mbappe. You? I think Bellingham. Do I think Mbappe. I think Mbappe's Mbappe. worth more. If a more world, than Mbappe. he's only tw- what, he's won a world 20? cup. You've got a hat trick in a world cup. Oh no, yeah. Mbappe's so, oh, just way to more sign valuable. on a fee. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Mbappe yeah, is more expensive. Yeah. Of course, but is. with with the age, you'd say yeah. But, but you forget how young Mbappe is. But twenty four. That's nuts. He's 24, 25. Is 24? he? You yeah. just said he's 25. Is it, did I say he's 25? <laughs> I think you so, You just yeah. checked his oh, age. Foden and Harlan both turned 24. Yeah, he's 25. 25. Foden and Harlan both turned 24. Look, he's not even in his prime, is he? That's Mbappé? crazy. He's going to he's gonna go. Mental. He's going to have a World Cup, about 1,000 goals for PSG, <laughs> go to Real Madrid <laughs> and turn into his prime. Yeah. Do you know what that's, that's what we all said he was going to do, right? Real yeah. Madrid. That when we were discussing his Saudi move, just come back and go... Mate, Real exactly. Madrid anyway. It is... It's, it's, it is a bit like it's still like mocking a bit how good Real Madrid could be next year. Yeah, there's no. But at the them, same really. time, they are Real Madrid. They've it, always been like that. Re- realistically, like it'll end up just being like City Real Madrid Champions League final every year. Yeah. It should be. It's not like Real Madrid have never done this, I and mean, it's like a shock what we're seeing happening mm. in football. Are we just going to have it where it's like not only leagues are monopolized? It's just like even the Champions League is going to be just like. But that's what the format but, of the Champions no, League is, isn't it? It's like almost a Super League of. I feel like there was time, more, I feel like Champions more teams in it. But I feel like Champions League's a knockout competition, so it's not necessarily monopolized. Changes next year, though. Yeah, what is the changes? Just um, more, I was listening to Carrig was explaining the, the other day. Isn't yeah, it? but it, it it actually sounds all right, you know. Yeah, it's oh, I, like, I don't. It's oh, I'm not even going to try and pretend to explain it because I don't really know. But it it, it does sound okay. It, it sounds better for like the lower teams and stuff. Okay, mm-hmm. it's more um, condensed. I think they they'll they'll have more of a chance of getting points and that. Well, you because you'll be you'll be seeded. I think and yeah, and, and the weird. big teams play. Have the you big noticed teams? as well? Yeah. You know, in the. Uh, Matches at the moment, all the big teams are facing lower teams and vice versa. Like, have you noticed that it's all it's quite evenly split across? It's the because most thingy. have just stormed their group, haven't yeah. they? The best teams have just stormed yeah. their group. Yeah. And you yeah. look at the Champions League actually, and you say it is the best competition in the world. You, I'd argue it's actually better pound for pound than the World Cup in terms of quality, but. There's that, some shit that's, teams. That's undeniable. The World Cup's yeah, not that good. There's some yeah. shit teams in the Champions League, isn't there? Like, yeah, 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 yeah. Copenhagen. Yeah, just Christ. based on, based off where they are they geographically. Are rubbish, to, aren't they? Yeah. It's good uh, to have them, though. No, well, yeah, well, yeah, well, yeah well, no, but some of the teams who come bottom yeah, of their you, groups... You don't, you don't appreciate the big ties you, until like, you... Some of those teams that come bottom the, of their groups in the Champions League they are, are fucking shit. Yeah. rubbish, aren't It's they? just fun Victoria having those shitters, though, because if they cause an upset against oh, Man United yeah. half the time, it's class. Yeah. Yeah. They are shit there if they go bottom of the league. Bottom yeah. of the yeah. group yeah. in the Champions League is really embarrassing. They're so tragic. He started to agree with it. I am silly, Victoria Pilsen, man! No, Newcastle. Yeah, Newcastle United, pal. Speaking of idiots... 